Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. For those who are new, Karibu Sana. In today's video, I'll be sharing with you Sean's bedroom makeover and how I made um, a ladder desk, how I made like a ledger shelf, picture frames, all that. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So I'm going to share with you how the room looks before I start any changes. So here is just his bed. The only thing I have removed was that uh, wooden thing. I don't know what it's called that was preventing him to fall down. So that we have removed. And then I'm going to put an art over here. And then this side I have this um, drawer something. It's plastic so i'm not going to do away with this i'm just going to move it into his wardrobe to arrange like socks and shoes and all that and then here i'm going to put a desk and then over here i'm going to put a desk and a chair for him and then this side i have this plastic chair but i'm going to remove it and put like an ottoman with a pillow and then above it i'm going to put like um, a ledger picture shelf then this other side i'm going to arrange some art for him then this side i want to put like a laundry basket for him and maybe another basket for extra toys and then maybe above i'm going to put like um a shelf not a shelf but uh a piece of wood with some hooks on it so that he can hang his school bag his jacket and all that but i don't know if i'm going to do this now but yeah that's all i want to do for this room <laughs> The first thing I did was to make the ladder desk. So right here, what you can see is I'm um, putting together the shelves and then I'm going to join everything together, paint it, varnish it, and put um, the tape that goes around the MDF with some glue. And then I'm just going to make it look cute. And the moon 
next thing that I want to make is a picture ledge shelf. So I'm using a 4x1, 3x1 and 2x1 wood and each of them is like 3 feet long. So I want to sand it and then join it together and then I'm also going to varnish it. going to vanish the picture frames before you ask i got the images from online and then i just printed them on glossy paper and then i took them to these people who frame mirrors and they framed them for me and for the three of them i think i paid around 600 700 shillings <laughs> I want to attach the picture ledge shelf on the wall but before that I'm going to drill holes because I want to use steel nails to join it to the wall. For the three picture frames, I measured where I wanted them to be and then I started with the middle one. I drilled the hole, put a screw in and then I put it then measured the other two the same distance from the middle one so that they would be at the center of his bed. So I also brought this macrame. It's written be kind. 
that's how it looks have a screen here how it looks it comes with this thingy that i'm supposed to attach to the wall I also changed his curtains and this is temporary as these are my living room curtains but I'm thinking maybe I should take them to the bedrooms. I got these books from Naivas and I, the plan is to fill this whole shelf with like storybooks and then I also have this like tiny elephant to just stay there then for the bottom part I have I have brought the Ottoman it has all his toys and stuff I have also brought this rug over here <laughs> so the theme is, is kind of navy blue yellow and gray so that's what we are working with and i have not found the perfect pillow to fit this case that i got from smart lady home so i'm just using a bed pillow but i think it looks okay down here a basket that i have put some of his extra toys and these are mostly stuffed animals then i also brought a laundry basket over there i will change this into either a white one or a gray one the moon, can I follow you back to your arms Wash it all off in the river of your hand. so for the bed i went really simple this is just his old duvet the only thing I've added to this bed is this throw pillow that the cover I also got from Smart Lady Home. And then I have also added this uh, fleece blanket that we were using in the living room because I think it like sort of agrees with the theme in here. And I think it looks pretty simple. Yeah, so that is all for his bed. And then the curtains, they look wonderful. These are the curtains from our living room. I'm still thinking whether to have these same curtains in the bedrooms or bring the living room curtains to all the bedrooms then I can get new ones for the living room but I'm not yet sure but these have turned out so good it has sort of enlarged um, the window and it's bringing so much light it looks really really good then this be kind um, macrame I got from smart lady home the plan was i wanted to make like a net a canopy net with like rainbow colors on the opening but i'm still looking for a net when i do that i'll update you then this one can move somewhere else but that's how it looks for now So this is the ladder desk that you saw us making earlier on and we also wanted to put a drawer but yeah the logistics of that were not just logistic in okay so we just decided to leave it open and then there are tiles here because as i said this house was previously occupied by students so each room had like tiles somewhere for the students to cook but i don't really mind them and now I want to decorate this space, so let's do that. this 
notebook of mine for vibes but that's not shorts so yeah that's how everything has turned out and i think it looks pretty neat so this is where he'll be doing most of his homework his painting all that stuff if he wants to read this is where he'll be coming and i wanted to get an ims chair for those who don't know what an ims chair is I am going to attach it on somewhere here so that's how it looks but when i ordered i ordered one from mabel homestyles but they didn't have them in stock so as i wait for them to restock you can also plug me where i can get an ims chair as i wait but for now we are using this same seat <laughs> that was in this room so yeah that's how it looks and i think it's turned out pretty great so yeah that is how everything turned out and i really like it i think we did a pretty good job and by we i mean my partner and i because we are doing this together so the theme was um yellow blue and gray and why we went with a sunshine or a rainbow theme is because one of sean's name means sunshine so i wanted this space to be as colorful as possible i didn't paint the walls because i thought that would be just a lot and overwhelming so i skipped to do that because i will be adding like maybe a few decorative touches that are really colorful i'm not going to show you what is in the wardrobe because it's a mess um as of right now but that is the whole makeover that we wanted for this room i would have also added a different light fixture but i am to make one that is sort of kid friendly or it has like a child theme so i'm still figuring out what i want to do with the light and then yeah we love how everything turned out it's really simple it's functional because he has a desk he has somewhere for storage he has a seat he has like artwork a place to store his books the only thing that i'm left to add is the coat or bag hanger and that one is pretty simple to do i'll just get a piece of wood put some hooks on it and then just drill it on the wall so i want to bring sean he has not seen this room yet so i want to bring him in here i just told him i have a surprise for him and he's really interested so i want to bring him in here to see it and we can get his reaction okay close your eyes i show you close 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 i'll tell you to open yes. wait wait Ta -da! Thank you. You're welcome. And your toy chest. It's mine. It's yours. Yes. And your bed. It's mine. And your new curtains. It's mine. Yeah, and that one, what does it say? Be kind. Be, be kind. No, be kind. No, it's be no. kind. <laughs> it's be kind, Baba. No. So you're not confused. Be kind. Good job. It's be kind. Okay. Be kind. No. <laughs> be kind. Yes. Now when you grow up, yeah. you be kind. Okay. Yes. Okay. And this one, what does it say? Read there. Sun. No. Up. Yeah. You are my sunshine. You are my sunshine. Yes, you are, Baba. The shiny. No. Shine. You're my sunshine. <laughs> Mom. Yeah. You have to sit. I got for mommy from. Yeah. I have it. So many. Do you like it? Yes. Okay. I tell them bye. Bye. Tell those ones bye. Bye. Please like this video. Please like this video. Comment down below. Comment down get below. And please subscribe. Please subscribe to Mommy's channel. To Mommy's channel. Until next time. Until next time. Bye bye. 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 Then do like this.
Oh no, do for them like this. Okay. But yeah, we love how everything turned out. Comment down below on what you think about it. So that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it motivates you to make over your child's room or your own room. Because really, hey, hey, Wanjiko, we really enjoyed doing this. And yeah, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. Comment down below on what you think about it. And please subscribe to my channel. We are on the road to 10,000 subscribers by the end of 2022. And I'll be really glad if you came on board to help me out. So yeah, that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. Until next time, bye. Watching you.